And Jeremy, experts say turkeys like to come up to the side of the interstate to pick gravel, grains, and seeds. And big birds near fast traffic can make for a dangerous combination. Call it a foul way to start the day. Just out of the blue, something came flying through my windshield and just happened to be a turkey. Truck driver James C. called was on his way to Illinois with a load of lettuce Wednesday morning. But as he was driving through the Neola area on I-80, he found himself with an extra passenger in the cab. Just all of a sudden, out of the blue, didn't see it, wasn't able to react to it or nothing. Just flew, just flew through the windshield. C called, called 911. He was okay, but the woman in the passenger seat needed treatment for cuts and scrapes. Here, you can even see first responders checking out the bird. Now, across Pottawatomie County, turkeys have been a growing problem. So bad that last winter, Council Bluffs even had a turkey hunting season. They just become more of a nuisance in the, in most in the recent years, kind of like the deer. City and county officials say they're not aware of any official counts on the turkey population, and most accidents create so little damage they don't need to be reported. But when a bird hits a windshield at highway speeds, it does more than ruffle a few feathers. Things can happen, but I'm just glad nobody was actually really seriously hurt behind this. Experts say turkeys tend to be worse in the spring, and if you see a turkey while you're driving, do not swerve to miss it. You could cause a worse accident. And just like deer, turkeys tend to come in groups, so if you see one, there are probably others around. Back to you. All right.